Welcome back. So, back in the shed. Time to get this all painted up. Uh, body shorts everywhere here. Um, got it all set up the bench, so I'll give you a look. Okay, so I've got everything here. Uh, got my body shorts. I have a lovely body suit. A um, few other bits and pieces, lots of drop sheets, thinners, uh, body shorts gun. Yeah, so everything to do what I need. Also bought some new respirators or organic vapor filter for my mask. mask uh, the, the mask I bought was for welding and grinding, cutting, all that kind of stuff. I used it a little bit for painting, but not the best. So brought the proper one with the other bits and pieces. Um, so time to tape it all up and get ready. Okay, all good. Ready for body shorts. So, just taste caped up, uh, rear wires, few bolt holes, just the, the cable routing pipes. Um, up the front, pretty much the same. Just wanted to keep these ones black, and um, yeah, looking good. Time to get suited up and uh, paint this bitch. So, one thing I didn't want to show you was this mask which is 3m mask but you can also change filters over so i've just changed from welding filter to paint mask and easy to buy i think the, the filters cost me about 40 bucks um and yeah the mask was about 100 comes in a kit with uh whichever set you you choose and pretty good even though I'm looking pretty sexy in this uh, outfit, definitely need one of these. So, just thought I'd show you that. Perfect to use. I'm really happy with it. Uh, came out pretty well. Uh, I had a little bit of a problem. I don't know. I think my camera stopped filming for a little bit. But up in here, I, the gun was all blocked up. And don't lend your gun to someone else. So yeah, it all worked pretty well. Got it all pretty covered. I just wanted it on on everything. So if I'm taking it off road or anything else like that, it just 
it's just an undercoating to, to give it a bit of bit of protection from rocks and whatnot and uh, yeah came out really good so it's just a rubberized texture nothing too exciting but yeah just sort of get it on get it on there before I undercoat it and oh before I paint underneath so as before pretty much as you've seen just all dried out now um, just gonna mix up the paint and start to get it all painted up just going with uh, a semi-gloss uh, grey pretty close to the the factory colour of of the undercoat that I can find anyway it's, it's not going to be uh, perfect but should do the job so let's get this on the road okay let's go got my sexy suit ready uh, washed down all the floors got it uh, pretty wet just so it's not kicking dust up not that it's going to really matter considering I'm painting the other side of the car that I've already uh, textured with the uh, um, body shields but should be pretty good and this way I'm not going to paint my whole floor as well so let's get into it <music> pretty good it uh, I got my gun was, was stuffing up for a little bit but um, got it sorted in the end but yeah pretty pretty good I'm happy with that it um, it laid on pretty well it the black stuff really sucked in the paint um, so it took a few more layers than I thought but it's bloody done so happy but I blew my knees out Look at that. Getting on my knees. Better take you in for a look. Almost forgot. So, yeah, not too bad. All on there. So it's just a satin, satin grey. I just, oh, on the earlier Volkswagens, I just like the, the grey on the bottom. It shoots, like when you paint it, you shoot a little bit around here and it gets on there a little bit, which gives like a factory look which I'm not sure if I'll tape it along the edge and, and not get that or, or leave it how it is but really happy with how it finished but damn 
it was messy. So, done for the day, done for this week's project. Happy with the job. Uh, time to let it cool down, cool down. Time to let it dry and set up. And then next week we're gonna start button up little bits and pieces, put on like bump stops and linkages and stuff like that. The stuff I can do with it underneath. I still need to paint on the on the inside, so I can't put the pedals and stuff in. Otherwise, I have to mask them up. And in reality, it's only one 13 mil bolt, so not too worried with that. Um, yeah, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.